Hello, what is up you guys? It is your girl Kiera. Welcome back to the channel and welcome if you are new. So you guys, we are back here in Berry Avenue. You guys, I was thinking about it and I think I want to actually check to see if Amber is actually working on the game right now. I know that we are all like currently waiting on an update and earlier she was actually in the game working on the update but then after that she actually like left and then like she came back again. I don't know what was going on but let's check and see if Miss Girl is online and actually working on Barry Avenue right now because we need an update. If I head over to Roblox once again, I'm going to head over to the group, which is Amberry Games. We're going to head down to the little message that she left for us. We're going to head over. Oh my goodness, you guys! She is currently working on a game right now. I also saw that I think the game was called Parenthood. I don't remember what it was called, but one of those games that I think they're like kind of co like working on together or something like that. That was like locked and closed and not available to be played either. So I don't know what's going on. Oh, it was this game actually. It was called Parenthood. It says Parenthood closed for rework. So I don't know what's, you know, going on. I think she maybe, you know, works on this sometimes. I really don't know. I think that right now, this second that I'm filming, Amberry is currently working on Barry. Avenue so that is so exciting that the girl is actually you know active and working on the new update all right you guys so now it's time to get ready for what you guys actually came here for and that is a few things that you guys probably did not know that even existed in Barry Avenue I have like a list I might like add on to my list as well but let's go ahead and you know go to the first little location you guys I honestly just found out about this a couple days ago for this specific little you know thing or whatever um I do have to use my um my free cam so i have to go ahead and use shift p to like actually show you guys what it is but it is by i guess you can say like anywhere but the first place that i actually found it was actually by the tennis court so we're gonna head over here and the first thing i want to show you guys is up on these buildings i'm gonna click shift p head on all the way up and if we go all the way up you guys oh my goodness <gasps> There are secret elevators, you guys. This is so cool. There's an elevator on this side. There's also like a secret little elevator over here, you guys. Literally just a couple days ago, I like realized that these things even exist. I wonder if there's any more because those are like the two first ones that a girl actually ended up seeing. But I don't know, you guys, there might be some over there. I'm really not sure, but there like literally isn't any possible way for like me to actually get up here other than using my free cam but yeah you guys there is like elevators up in here like the thing is it's like the elevators actually have like electricity with them the buttons light up there's lighting inside you guys like I don't know is this supposed to like be something will this ever be something is this gonna be a part of the new update like I really don't know but it's like pretty much you know ready to be used like there's lighting there's buttons like it's looking like you know it has to be used by an actual user so that's pretty cool but as i said um these are things that i just realized i think that these have been here for a while though there's also an elevator little system over here as well as the same exact one as the one over there but this is just so cool i mean like it's kind of you know decorated for like role players and stuff like that like oh my goodness but yes this is the first little secret that you probably would not have known about berry avenue especially if you were on mobile i know that it is like almost impossible to like get up here without you know free cam and things like that for the second location oh my goodness y'all where is my car for the second location i'm going to go ahead and head over to the grocery store this is also something that i think that has been here like for a while as well and I was just like, I don't know about y'all, but like when I'm like playing the game by myself, oh, I just passed it. Oh my goodness. When I'm like playing the game by myself, like I like to explore the map and like areas that like we can't really go into like with my free cam. So I go into like all these empty buildings and just like look at them to see like what's inside and like all those kind of things. But if we head over to the food market, the uh, grocery store, I always call it the supermarket. I'm not sure why, but this is a food market. But if we head on in, I don't know why I am. I'm walking so slow but if we head on in to the food market i'm going to go ahead and walk back to this little back room i'm going to enter in free cam wait let me show you guys something if i walk to this store over here the e like icon pops up like i'm not able to like actually go in even when i put on the whole like uniform over here i literally still cannot get into this room i don't know if this is just happening to me or what you guys but a girl cannot get up in here so see i'm like clicking e i'm like clicking i'm like doing everything and i cannot get in it's like but hold on like there has to be something inside right let's go ahead and see what's inside you guys 
Y'all, I ended up finding uh, this secret room once again. Uh, this is a little storage room and it has boxes. All of these shelves that are like empty and stuff like that. I guess uh, like maybe in the future they would like make it so that we can like restock the shelves because like the shelves are like basically like almost empty for most of the time. If you do want to go ahead and enter in free cam, you can go through this little door over here and there is a whole storage room and this would be cute for, you know, role plays when working at the grocery store, but there's like, what, five boxes? No, there's four boxes oh my goodness my math but there is four boxes this is you know really pretty let me give you guys a little bit of the you know better view but wow i think with having all of these um secret locations and things it just kind of you know lets us know that there is more to come with barry avenue and that what is here already is not the end like there's like a lot more to come to barry avenue so that is like you know really exciting i'm gonna go ahead and head over to our next stop you guys i don't know why i keep going the next way but we're gonna head over to our next location and this one is honestly a little bit obvious it is just like a little bit of like a mini update that actually did end up happening i'll just really quickly for you guys but basically if you guys are like an older Barry Avenue player you guys would know that there used to be a uh, yellow school bus over here and you were like able to color it and things like that but now we have this more like tour kind of city bus transit bus kind of going on it is so like really nice it's more modern and it's different it also brings value to the game of course but the school bus is gone so Barry Avenue actually does not have a school bus like at all they used to have a school bus but I don't know what happened I didn't really look much into it but one day the school bus was just gone and we had this bus as well somewhere on my channel I do have like a video of me I don't know what the video was about but I was like being a school bus driver or something like that so if you guys do want to see like uh, the whole school bus and like how it looked and things like that it is in one of my older videos but this is you know what we have parked at the uh Barry high school you know it's very nice and modern though because you know a lot of other games they do use a school bus but for Barry Avenue, they had a different take on it, and they said, we're gonna have us, uh, you know, nice, modern, rich, rich bus, so, it's cute, it's nice, but yeah, Barry Avenue does not have a school bus, like, at all, at all, at all, so, that's, you know, really nice and unique to know, but yeah, you guys, no school bus. <laughs> if you are, like, really into role-playing, you might already know this, but for some of you guys that are new to Barry Avenue and things like that, you might not know this, but something very good and very new is that you can actually drive if you are a teenager, so I think that right now, I may be an adult. I'm not sure. Let me see. Okay, th yeah, I think I'm an adult right now, so I'm going to switch over to 18, and you are actually able to drive as a teen. That is actually the youngest age that you can drive for the, like, actual bigger adult cars. You guys already know that we have, like, the smaller cars for, like, the babies and the toddlers, but if you're a teenager, you can, like, actually drive. So, like, if you're doing a role play and you're, like, 13 years old in the role play and, like, you're logged in to be a teenager in Barry Avenue, you can drive as a 13-year-old in Barry Avenue. So, that is, you know, kind of cool. So, I can literally be, like, well, 14, 13 years old, and I'm just here driving a random car with some pink wheels. Like, oh my goodness, child. I actually found that out like a while ago. This isn't anything that's too, too new for me. But just a little quick tip for those role players and things like that. You know, you could, you know, drive. Let's try something out. I think they're going to ask me to switch my age if I do drive as a child. But oh my goodness, I'm so cute and tiny. You aren't the correct age to do that. Um, let me see if I can bring out one of the uh, little baby cars and see if I'm too old for this as well Ooh, okay so as a child I can drive a police car oh my goodness y'all I was like does it drive that slow are you serious y'all this is so slow ah. y'all I actually don't know if I've ever like driven one of these cars before y'all this car is like meant for like the sidewalk or something because what is going on like I have to like come over here and like drive on the sidewalk you guys oh my goodness Y'all, this is literally like the slowest car ever. It is so cute though. Can I even fit over here? <gasps> Y'all, can you imagine? I have to like go on the road a little bit, you guys. But this car is definitely something for like your neighborhood or something because it is just so like small and petite and... I don't know, I would not recommend driving this on the main roads because some things, you know, just may end up happening, but we're not gonna do that, you guys. We're gonna stay safe and actually stay on the sidewalk, but, like, when you, like, first start up the car, it's, like, so slow, like, oh my goodness. Anyways, you guys, let me turn back into an adult at least, okay? Let's turn back into an adult, okay, Chia? We go, yeah, that's, like, a lot better. The next thing is actually in the little items menu. If I head over to fire, oh, I can do fire or I can do jump. 
jobs i'm not sure but i'm gonna go ahead and click on this over here a fire extinguisher i think this was called you guys i found this out today like i was finding out so many new things about barry avenue but basically i'm gonna go ahead and go into shift p one more time you guys but i realized that there are actual real instructions on how to use a fire extinguisher you guys you can literally learn how to use one in the berry avenue game so as you guys can see it there are like actual instructions number one is to pull pin holds unit upright start back eight feet aim at base of fire squeeze lever and sweep side to side you guys they're like literal like actual real instructions that you can use and then of course like for all this like other like little writing over here this isn't like readable at all it's like blurred out and stuff like that but there's like actual like this is so cool it looks so like legit which i think it is like i did not know that this was a thing like look at this tiny writing i think over here it was gonna say warning i can identify warning i think but i think this was gonna say caution so this is gonna be the last little thing for things that you probably did not know about berry avenue and then after this i'm gonna go back and check back on Amberry. you guys i don't think you guys understand when i tell you guys that i've literally been checking into roblox every single day like every single hour seeing if berry avenue updated like i'm just so ready for this update I'm gonna really try my best to like really stay on top of these upcoming updates but you guys I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the last little thing you probably did not know about Barry Avenue and this actually includes my nails so I did get a couple comments um based on my nails on like how I got my nails and things like that and like other things like that and honestly it's like a lot you have to go ahead and go in to avatar then you have to go on up to the little like um shirt icon then we're gonna head over to jackets and then when you're in jackets you're gonna see a lot of like different things that literally are not jackets like these things over here what are there are these like shoes what what's this yeah you literally get shoes in the jackets icon but anyways i'm gonna take those um off actually we're gonna take those off really quickly but if we head back to clothing and the little middle icon with the t-shirt and head over to jackets there are a lot of non-jacket items we have like sleeves and all those kind of things i'm gonna head over to search and i'm going to type in nails okay and once you type in nails you guys we have a good enough variety these are like the blue ones that i had on before i just love these nails i have to see who the creator is because it is just so creative you guys and there's like actual like texture to them it looks like and that is like pretty hard and like i'm guessing it's pretty hard to do um but i'm gonna head back over there you guys it's like a lot to like get back but i'm gonna type in nails once again and oh my goodness i did not go to jackets <laughs> let me go make sure you guys head over to a jackets and there are like a different nails and things like that i want to be able to like actually show you guys but yeah you just have to like pick the nails that actually match your hands a lot of these don't even like go to my hands like you see these ones over here like they're not even like touching my hands at all but the ones lower here lower down these are the blue ones i actually had on you guys so cute and then these ones over here these are some more pink ones these ones are like some french tip oh i think these ones are gonna be my next ones these are so cute they're like these pink french tip with like pearls and bows who is the creator of these nails this one is by forever up and then oh, y'all forever up y'all are so creative like i love these nails so much so let's go ahead and actually end off this video and check on Amberry one more time you guys once again we are back here in the roblox i'm gonna head over to groups i'm gonna head over to Amberry games and we're going to stalk this girl one more time oh my goodness yeah ah, she's still working on an update on a game i don't know you guys hopefully it is the update all right you guys that is the ending of today's video today we went over a few things that you probably did not know about Barry Avenue avenue this video is targeted a little bit more towards the new berry avenue role players or people that are just new to the game overall so if you guys do want more videos like this one please let me know by liking this video and subscribing for more videos like this one and i'll be seeing you guys in my next video bye peoples hopefully the update comes out in my next video you guys